urban bass slayers can't stop, won't stop. We're on a fishing mission, on a mission to be fishing. And I wish I was fishing, so we're going fishing. Got off work, busting our butt, uh, working up in Rescue, California. And we were driving Highway 50 up to this little pond that we found on Fish Brain. And due to some really sad circumstances, I caught a uh, two pound sunfish the other day at a spot and somebody saw their pictures. So they proceeded to go out there and catch just about every sunfish that was in that spot, like 10 to 15 fish, and threw them all in a bucket and took all of the sunfish out of there. Like you couldn't just take two and go to another pond and take another couple fish. You gotta take 15, 20 fish out of one pond and completely destroy it. It's those kind of people that I really don't like fishing and people that litter every time they go out to fish. Two people that I loathe. I mean, stuff happens with like your line, you'll snap off and you'll get line in the water. But that's stuff that happens. But I mean, when you walk out and you have a brand new package you just pull the crankbait out of and you throw it on the ground, why? I mean, you're just, you're ruining your fishing spots. And then a couple more years, when all these places are fished out and you can't fish them, and everybody's gonna get mad because there's no fishing spots. You'll know why, because everybody, they don't know how to properly manage their fishing. Taking a right right here. So anyways, so we, uh, <clears throat> we passed a spot the other day, Mosquito Creek Outfitters. And it was uh, it was closed, and there was a guy. He was leaving on a motorcycle, so I think they we probably passed her right when they were closing. So it's a uh, little local fishing shop. We're gonna go check it out. You'll see what they got inside here. I think I'm gonna take my camera just to get a little. I don't know if they'll let me film in here or not. I don't know. I'm just gonna do a little, a little footage of some stuff. I like going into little smaller places like this. I mean, I do shop Sportsman's Warehouse, Bass Pro Shop, Dicks, all those places, but. I love and love, love, love to shop small, uh, especially because I like to drink some beers. So, like when I drink beer, I, I buy from the local breweries around Sacramento. And I don't know, I just like helping small businesses get on their feet, build their dreams, you know what I mean? Kind of same thing with me. I mean, one day this will be something. Urban bass layers will be bigger than I've ever imagined, I hope. Gonna go in here, Mosquito Creek Outfitters. Check it out. They're best there's. How's it going? Yeah, I've had another trip. Those are actually really good. Got a nice little selection of stuff. Bad targets. Ooh, they made a smaller one. Cast 2015. Basic little selection of stuff. Ooh, that color's nice. These things right here are just. Those are so nice. I don't have any cash on me right now. I'm going to buy some more. Ooh, look at that color. Oh, and they're the double tails. I would say this color. Wait for that water, watermelon red. If you want to, if you don't know what to buy, and you don't know what color to get, watermelon. If you don't know what color to buy of plastics, watermelon red. Watermelon red has always done me. Or black and blue. Yep. That's what we need to get next is a new net. It's a pretty nice robo color selection. <laughs> nice, those are awesome for drop shotting. And you just shake them, yeah. the tails just flutters. Yeah. Got a pretty cool little selection of stuff in here. Stuff to hand tie. And uh, crawfish and stuff. And stuff. It's a basic little fishing store. Pretty cool. It's like, 
Can you check it out? Looks like we're gonna get some of these. Yamamoto, double tail. I just I put this on the chatter rate. Anyways. So we are calling this the little sleeper pond because it's a little sleeper. A little tiny dink pond with some big fish in it. Um, dude caught like a four and a half, five pounder over here. So we were fuck we were uh, catching a bunch of good ones yesterday. Running these things a thousand miles an hour. We're gonna do the same pattern right now. Get it in there and reel it, reel it, reel it. They're best layers. I'm 